guys, welcome back to our channel here at EOS Marketplace News. My name is Alex and I will be your correspondent for today. Now, for today's news, I will be giving you the price analysis for the top 10 cryptocurrency. Alright, so I know that you are really excited, so I'm just giving, I will be giving you the details in a bit. But before that, I'm just going to greet everyone who's watching this video for our subscribers and our viewers. Um, have a lovely day. Alright, I'm saying hi to all my friends out there. I hope that you are enjoying your day as well. Alright, so guys, without further ado, let me give you the top 10 cryptocurrencies price analysis as of November 26. Now this news is brought to us by PCN or Preferred Currency News. Okay. So, here. The digital currencies were relatively stable from early September of mid-November, after which the decline started. Since then, incessant selling dragged the total market capitalization of cryptocurrencies from above $210 billion on November 14 to just below $116 billion on November 25, a fall of close to 45%. After such a waterfall decline, an equally sharp pullback is probable. However, the markets will not switch over from a strong bear face to a bull face instantly. Mike Novogratz, ex-Goldman Sachs partner and founder of Galaxy Digital, believes that the cryptocurrencies will stage a turnaround next year. While the fall has hurt traders' accounts, it has not stopped the adoption of cryptocurrencies. In an ap apparent first, businesses in the U.S. state of Ohio will be able to pay their taxes in Bitcoin. This facility may possibly be extended to the individual taxpayers in the future, according to the Wall Street Journal. <clears throat> okay, let's start. So first up, Bitcoin and USD. Bitcoin dropped to a low of $3,620.26 on November 26, from where the bulls attempted a pullback that hit a roadblock just above the $4,200 level. Currently, the bears are attempting to resume the downtrend. The zone between $3,000 to $3,500 is an important support and we expect it to hold. So the fall in the last few days has plunged the RSI into deeply oversold levels. Though in a bear phase, the RSI frequently stays close to the oversold zone. A reading of 11 on the RSI indicates capitali um, capitulation. Usually, such a sharp decline is followed by an equally sharp throwback rally. The BTC and USD pair will face a minor resistance at the downtrend line, but we expect it to be crossed. The upside targets are a pullback to 38.2% Fibonacci re um, retracement level of $4,712.89 and a 50% retracement level of $5,050.40. So the 20-day EMA is also just above this level and might act as a stiff resistance. It is a difficult to trade to um, the rebound. Hence, only experienced traders willing to take a risk should attempt to go long. If the virtual currency sustains $4,250 for about 4 hours, the stop loss can be kept just below $3,500. As this is a risky trade, use only 30% of the usual allocation. On the downside, if the digital currency breaks below $3,620.26, a fall to $3,000 is likely. Right. Next, XRP and USD. Ripple broke down the support of $0.37185 on November 25, but buying at lower levels helped it recover most of the intraday losses. The bears are currently attempting a sell-off once again. If successful, the XRP and USD pair can decline to the support line of the channel, which will act as a strong support. However, if the level fails um, 
to hold a retest of $0.24508 is possible. On the other hand, if the bulls push prices above $0.37185, a pullback will begin that can extend to $0.43, where we anticipate a strong resistance from the 20-day EMA. We do not find any buy setups, hence we are not suggesting a trade in it. <clears throat> Next, ETH and USD. So the buyers seem to have deserted Ethereum because there is not even a reasonable attempt to pull back after such a decline. On November 25, the bears easily broke below the support of $110. <clears throat> the ETH and USD pair found some support at $102.96, but the pullback has been weak. A break of the $102.96 level can drag the digital currency to $83. On the upside, the, um, the recovery will face roadblocks at $130 and $140. If these two levels are crossed, a pullback to $158 is possible. However, we do not find any reliable buy setups. Hence, it is best to stay on the sidelines. Um, next, BCH and USD. As the hash war in Bitcoin Cash is over, we have reintroduced in our analysis. Due to the fork, we will have to look at it afresh. Um, within a short span of 20 days, the decline has been massive. The bulls are attempting to provide support close to $148.27. So if they succeed, a pullback to 38.2% um, Fibonacci retracement and 50% retracement of their recent fall is probable. If the bulls fail, the BCH and USD pair might extend its downtrend. Though it is uncharted territory, the next major support is at $100, so traders can wait for a bullish pattern to form before initiating any long positions. Okay, next, XLM and USD. Stellar broke below the critical support of $0.184 and $0.154788, which is a bearish sign. Um, it found some buying at $0.1342705.0, but the bulls are struggling to sustain the pullback. A breakdown of the November 25 lows will resume the downtrend and push the XLM and USD pair to the next support at $0.8. Any recovery will face a still um, stiff resistance at the $0.184 level. <clears throat> we do not find any reliable buy setups, hence are not proposing a trade in it. Right Next, EOS and USD. Though the RSI is in oversold territory, the bulls could not initiate a recovery in EOS as it continues to trade below the $3.8723 level. So the immediate support is at $3. So if the EOS and USD pair bounces off this support, it will face a minor resistance at the downtrend line, above which $3.8723 will act as a major resistance. If the bears plummet prices below $3, the next support is at $2.40. <clears throat> Traders should wait for a trend reversal before attempting to buy it. Next, LTC and USD. Litecoin is in a firm bear grip. It broke its support at $32 and fell to a low of $28 on November 25. There has been no reasonable pullback since the decline started on November 14, which shows a lack of buying interest by the bulls. Below $28, the next support is at $20, but considering the oversold readings on the RSI, we anticipate a pullback within the next few days. On the upside, the recovery will face <clears throat> a stiff hurdle at the 20-day EMA. We expect the LTC and USD pair to form a range before starting a new uptrend. Until then, we suggest traders remain on the sidelines. Next, ADA and USD. Lack of buying pushed Cardano to 0 0.033065 on November 25. If this support breaks, the slide can extend to the next support at 0 0.02. 
5954. All right. So, um the RSI in deep oversold levels um that can result in a pullback that will face resistance in the zone of 0 $0.50 and the 20-day EMA. We shall wait for a confirmed bottom to form and the chart pattern to signal a reversal before suggesting a trade on the ADA and USD. Next, XMR and USD. So guys, Monero broke below the support of $60 and slipped to $54.081 on November 25. If this level is broken, there is a psychological support at $50, below which the slide can reach the $40 level. If the bulls hold the support of $54.81 and begin a recovery, the XMR and USD pair can rise to $71 and above that to $81. We expect a strong resistance at $81. Due to the oversold readings on the RSI, <clears throat> we anticipate a recovery within the next few days. However, there are no buy setups yet, hence we are not recommending a trade in it. Okay, last but not the least, TRX and USD. Oh, Tron is brought back. Tron broke down of the support at $0.0122194 and dipped to an intraday low of $0.0109965 on November 25. The bulls have managed to hold prices close to the November 20 lows, but they have not been able to push prices higher. The RSI is deeply oversold which shows that selling has been overdone. A recovery from the current levels can carry the TRX and USD pair to the overhead resistance of $0.0158768 where we expect sellers to step in. Contrary to our opinion, if the bears continue to pound the digital currency, a fall to $0.0084479 is possible. Traders should wait for a new buy setup to form before buying. All right. So, guys, that has been the um, update for the top 10 cryptocurrencies price analysis as of November 26. Okay. So, um, guys, um, I know that you want to be updated every day, especially about our favorite coins or token now please visit preferredcurrency.news and subscribe now in subscribing you will be the first one to get notified of the new updates um, <clears throat> you can use your preferred method there are two uh, first you can use your paypal for a month of recurring for only 15 dollars per month fiat or you can use the coinbase option for 180 dollars annual subscription to be paid with your favorite crypto all right now guys you can contact us directly through the website your name and email is required and of course your message if ever you have concerns questions and suggestions right now you can also contact the man behind preferred currency dot news directly his name is donald lewis or donald the guru you can call his number at 1-801-601-8105 WhatsApp 1801-471-6939 and Skype ID Donald.fcda. For Twitter subscribers, you can follow him at Preferred Crypto. You can join our Telegram channel, PreferredCrypto.news, and you can send a private message. You can send a message to Donald on Telegram at, at Preferred Crypto. Okay, that's at Preferred Crypto. All right, so guys, um, let me show you a glimpse of what will you be getting when you subscribe to our um, to Preferred Currency News. Okay, you will be getting a newsletter each and every day, um, 12 hours before we post videos here on YouTube, and that's via email. All right, so this is the newsletter that we will be sending. Of course, the article of the day and some top articles or trending articles are available but don't worry because when you click 
continue reading, it will take you to the page where a lot of news is available or articles are available for you. All right, but the most important part here is the Donald's research list. Okay, Donald's research list cannot be found anywhere else on the internet, but only here at Preferred Currency News, right? So, um, guys, here, let me show you. Here, this is the Donald's research list, okay? So, it has already been updated again, November 27, 2018. Now, for those doesn't have any idea about it these first column um, are the names of the tokens or coins so this is a complete list of tokens and coins and their statuses and it's updated every day but for your information guys this sheet is not a recommendation to buy or sell okay you must research each token or coin that you would like and then you can decide afterwards right now let me show you an example okay so i gave you the price analysis for um the top 10 as of november 26 now for today november 27 bitcoin's recent price it's three thousand eight hundred zero two uh three thousand eight hundred two point eight two four four one seven five seven share of total market volume it's zero point three three six two nine seven six three google searches compared to the past seven days it's 61 percent it's crossing down 50 for sma movement number of positive technical indicators four 24 hours volume versus price is zero seven days volume versus price it's 1.6 30 days volume versus price it's 2.1 and percent issued it's 82.83 percent all right now guys maybe you are wondering is it really complete yes look take a look there right so since it's a lot then here bitcoin aux one world ace um, a chain, ad bank, adex, ad shares, ad token, elf, air, aeon, aaron. Okay, so if if the token or coin that you're looking for is not on this first part, okay, then you would scroll down, right? Where is that? Okay, now guys, let me teach you. There is an easier way to do that to find the name of the token or coin. You just need to um, press Control F. All right, and then type down, for example, um, DAV. There. So for DAV, there. So DAV's recent price as of November 27. Oh, it's showing the best news because it's colored blue. Now, DAV recent price is 0 0.00302557. Share total market volume is 0 0.00000. 205 0% for Google searches it's crossing down 50 for SMA movement 4 for number of technical positive technical um tech positive technical indicators 0 for 24 hours volume versus price 7 days volume versus price it's 0 0.13 30 days volume versus price 0 and percent issued it's 32.94% all right, so guys, that easy, that convenient. Now, what's the advantage thing for this? Okay, first, you can have a copy of the Donald's research list if you subscribe. So if you have a copy of each and every day status, then you can keep track how the coin or how is that token working, right? Or how is that doing? All right, now, next is that it's very easy to access we it's part of the newsletter that we will be sending you so no need to ask um friends or no need to ask anyone else but we will notify you that hey here's the update for today all right third is that you don't need to spend a lot of time on researching on every website that you can open so that you can find what's the status of that specific token or coin right and again this um, spreadsheet cannot be found anywhere else but only here at preferred currency news all right
so guys that's it it's very easy um very um, convenient easy to understand now maybe you're wondering why is there a lot of colors blue yellow i see tan i see blue green rather so red if you see red it's it means negative news orange and tan neutral yellow are fair green have good news and blue are showing the best news all right so guys again you can have it all here at preferredcurrency.news okay with only just 15 dollars per month fiat you can have it all so easy life happy life here at preferred currency news so guys thank you so much for watching this video and if you have some concerns comments and suggestions please feel free to comment down below all right please don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe this has been alex saying good night and have a great day bye